there are two types of countries. There is a Hay country and a non-Hay country. There was a treaty formed in 1961. Some countries joined and some countries did not. And just for your own edification, sometimes some join right now. Saudi Arabia joined one month ago. So it doesn't mean that some country uh, may not join tomorrow. Um, what does that mean to you? What it means to you is that if it's a Hague country, um, it only is a one step process. And that step means that you uh, authenticate your document with the Secretary of State where the document originated. If it's a non Hague country, it can be a three step process. It still has to go to the state, but then it has to go to the Department of State and get what we call legalized. And then if you would like us to, we can submit it to the embassy for you. And once you get that back, you can use it in any country that you would like. So it is very important that you know what country this document is going to be used. Now, I'm just going to tell you that some people say to me, what's the difference? Why, why does it matter? I mean, I'm just going to get this document, and I'm going to use it when, um, when I want to, wherever I want to. Um, that doesn't work because the Secretary of State logs you in as to your country of destination. So if anybody tries to tell you that you can just do it, I just put it in an envelope, send it up to the Secretary of State. Don't worry about where you're going to use it. Don't worry about anything else. That is going to be your rejection. That's what that's going to be. So I uh, encourage you to do your research if you like and read about it and learn about it, but use us or another uh, company like us who we, we've, we've studied it, we've read it, we've done it, we are... We've been in business for eight years. We know it and we will help you, um, whether you're a law firm, whether you're a business, whether you're an individual person, we will help you and we will save you time and money.